Hello babes, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sadie, if you're new here, please follow me on Instagram. We're trying to flex the gram. It is literally the hottest day and I've had to shut the window because my neighbor, he feels like mowing at 10 in the morning. I mean, 10's fine, but I think ever since we've got the noise complaint, he's coming for me. He's found my YouTube and he's like, nah, we ain't having it. We're in a war right now, so. That is good. Today is actually gonna be a hair video. I have never done anything with my hair on my YouTube, so this could be fun. And it's sort of like a first impressions review. Also, if you hear drilling, I'm just gonna hope that you can't, but you might hear drilling, but it's all right. Cause hopefully my annoying whiny voice will drown it out. <laughs> but yeah, that is why my hair's looking a little bit lackluster. You know, the grease is hopefully gonna be the glue that holds my ponytail together. But yeah, today we're going to be reviewing a very popular brand. You've probably seen it everywhere on Instagram. It is Lula Bells. We're going to be reviewing one of their ponytails. I'm sure you have seen this style everywhere. It's kind of like that Bella Hadid 90s retro short ponytail that like bounces under. Hayley Bieber's wore it. Ariana Grande, of course, has wore it. So I'll insert some pictures. I just love this look. I tried to do it with my own hair before. I'll try and put a picture up. But at the time it was too long. It just looked like a normal ponytail. So I've actually had a Lula Bells ponytail before, but it is way too light for my hair now because honestly the whole top of my hair is like black basically. Also, do you love my new necklace? It's from Anna Lou of London. I hope it's on the right way. Will you even be able to know? because I went to a bar the other day and I was chatting to someone and they were like what's your name and I was like oh it's here and they were like e-i-i e-i-i-i-o oh. and I was like what the fuck they're like you put your name on backwards that's just so embarrassing it's like I always think I'm like Karen from Mean Girls you know when she puts the K on backwards that is like when she's going to prom that is 100% some shit that I would do. If you like my videos, it'd be great if you can give me a little thumbs up and subscribe, of course, because I do two videos a week, fashion, beauty, lifestyle, mainly me just chatting absolute shite, and somehow some people want to hear it. I don't know. It's, it's news to me too, honestly. It baffles me, but yeah. All right, without further ado, let's just get on wrapping this ponytail. So, packaging, cute. We like the little paisley print size of it. It says, let's get sassy and social. I want to get sashy. Sashy? Sashy. I want to get sassy, but I don't want to be social anymore because July was a hectic month, you know? I saw, I love my friends, but I saw a lot of people and it's just a lot for my little anti-social brain to handle, do you know what I mean? There's only so much of my personality I can give out. My social meter is, it's filled up. So August is gonna be, I say that, but probably be out next week. August is gonna be a time to recenter, so I ain't getting social, but, but further ado, let's just open this. Ooh, I love how it comes in this little protective packaging, which is great because I store them in there so they don't get all that static because it isn't actually real hair. That's why they are so cheap. These are 25 pound, which is insane for like a hair piece that looks as good, but they always have discount codes. So do you know what? I didn't put lip gloss on today. Now the lip gloss is on, we're ready to get sassy and social like Lula Bell says. Okay, looks longer than I thought it was gonna be. Does that match my hair? Right, so they have a colour matching service, which you can either email them or DM them. I DM'd them on Insta because I used to be the colour Blondette, which matched my balayage perfectly. But because it's a ponytail, you're only going to see this bit of my hair. So it's like black, really. So I think that looks like a pretty good match. It's chocolate brown, chalk brown. Of course, mine had to be something to do with food because I'm a fat shit. <laughs> Premium clipping, hair extensions. It's the Mini Grande 18 inch bounce. Bring the bounce back, bring the, bring the bounce back. It's steady, are you ready? Do you like that song? I love Little Mix. Honestly, when I saw them, it was actually amazing. It was unreal. I felt the bad B energy in the room. We were all like, this is a shout out to my ex. Hurry and I'm so I need to stop singing on here because I think some of you are going to think I'm actually being serious and that's my voice, but it's not. But I could actually sing if I tried. I definitely can't. I used to sing when I'm younger, but now I can't go that high anymore. I used to be able to sing high, but your voice is a muscle that you need to train. Also, they do offer this thing where you can order like a string of the colour with it, and then you can hold it up to your hair before you open this, because once you open this, you cannot send it back, okay? Just a little heads up. Which then you can send back the little piece of hair and get a refund, which I think is great. And they colour match you, they're always, they seem very good at customer service. All the girls look bad and bougie, like Jess Hunt in this ponytail. That's not where you want to get it. I was fully influenced. So let's just get it out. Does this match my hair? 
Do you know what? I would say my hair is slightly darker. Can you see? But it's, you probably can't see in the light. But it's a pretty good match. Also, please can appreciate it. I haven't washed my hair. It's disgusting. Because... Ugh, I knew I should have worn lip gloss. Because... When you wash your hair, it just goes too soft. And if you're doing a ponytail, you need a bit of slick, a bit of grease. You're not going to see it all. I'm hopefully just going to slick it back. You can do this look with little bits down. But you know what? I think I got my bits done too short. The hairdressers, I need them to grow out a bit. So, yeah, we're just going to slick it all back today. So I like to usually keep the net and put it back in. But it's sometimes a bit hard. Ooh, look at that. It's like a fucking animal. Do you know, fun fact, one time, when I used to, I used to wear like clippings all the time. I loved them. Honestly, it just adds that elevation you need on a night out. And I, you, like, wash them. So you wash them, give them a little blow dry, give them a little curl, like, before a night out. You know the drill. And I left them in the sink, and my mum went in the bathroom, and she shat herself. She was like, oh, I thought there was a, an animal, like a raccoon in the sink. I was like, a raccoon? <laughs> all right, love. Oh my gosh, I dye my hair like this. I love it. So yeah, that's the ponytail part, and then this is the little part you wrap around, because I love that look. Like, you know when you have the hairband looks like your hair? That just looks so classy. You don't want to see hairbands, do you know what I mean? First things th first. It's come such a thirsty ho. Let's just get our hair into a very high ponytail now. My hair does not look good in a ponytail. This is why I like these things. Everyone's always like, why don't you wear your hair up? I'm like, I have the weirdest shaped head, the worst baby hairs, just doesn't go like, for me, putting my hair up will honestly take more effort than like doing a smoky eye or like, I could just wake up and my hair's, cause my hair's quite straight. I usually don't even have to brush it and I can leave the house. So to do it up and it look good, it's so much effort for me and no one understands. And then when I put it up, I'm like, I don't even look like good. So I'm hoping this solves all my problems. Can you just see my hairline? Like I don't want to complain, but like, that ain't normal. Like I usually have to put a bit of makeup on it so I don't look like I'm balding. <laughs> Such a weird thing to be insecure about, but honestly. Look at people's like hairlines in a ponytail and I'm like, damn, she's thick. But I'm sure they wear like things in their hair too. I'm just using like a brush to really. Oh, that's really scraped. Do you know what? The grease is really doing bits for me. I like an egg. This is Dawn. Other girls can do this in like one second. Like everything on my YouTube takes me so long. And when I watch other girls, I'm like, how are they so put together? But I know you lot understand me. You're my people. I found my people. All you on YouTube, I love that you're like, oh, we got the same first night. That makes me so happy because I've spent my whole life thinking I'm a freak. And now I've found honeys like you. Little weirdos together. Is that high enough? Honestly, you know when Chav's in school, like, scrape it back. This is my pathetic hair before. <laughs> Let me try and sort this out. I, I can't. Look at these bumps. Mm, quiff. Do you remember the days of the quiff? Like, I would genuinely do the fattest quiff to school. Just turn up like, I thought I was the fucking bee's knees. I can't. I was thinking to do a, a reaction video of like, how I used to do my makeup and hair and clothes in school. Would that be funny? Would you want to see that? Or recreating how I used to do my makeup in school, like with Dream Out Moves. I've done it now, that one's a bit better. I don't think that's normal to take that long to do a ponytail because that's just human basic skills you learn when you're a kid, right? And then a classic Audi hairspray, I just put it on my hand and then scrape back all the... Oh, my ba my baby hair's honestly flying to Africa. Like, why are you flying away? I need to get like some gel and a toothbrush and like stick it. Oh dear, I've got devil horns. This has now become not a Lula Rebels re review, but Sadie trying to slick down her baby hairs for 10 minutes straight. They look good from here, but can you see it? It's like, fly it's still flying to Africa. I'm tempted to cut it off. You can't cut them off though, can you? Because that makes it worse. Look what I noticed, a little friend down here. Baby girl, are you okay? I'm about to have a breakdown. <laughs> I'm not doing it again. I'm just gonna have to clip this bit up. Okay, now I look lovely like an egg. Beautiful. Let's actually do what we came here to do and get the paint out in. Can I put my earrings in or is that gonna get interfere with it? Let's put my earrings in. Oh, there, that, that's better, isn't it? Maybe I need bigger hoops. Bigger the hole, bigger the hole. Oh, oh, it's gone really static. It is synthetic hair, but you can wash it. So I hope it like, you just gotta look after synthetic hair and it'll be all right. So this is the situation i hope you can see it's a little clip which goes into your ponytail and then this velcro strap wraps around right i've had these ponytails before 
no, 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 no. They're very, very difficult to do, but we're gonna try. You need a lot of clips. You can't just put it in with this. So let's just do what we can. I should have done, maybe I should have done two headbands. Oh, Jesus. No. I'm scared. I'm scared. Is it in? It's four now already. I actually feel like I need to pray to, I need to sacrifice a goat just to get this in my hair. Look at that, like it just falls off straight away. Like it's so, it's such a heavy piece of hair. The Velcro sticks to your hair and actually is painful. No. <laughs> ah! Oh, ow, ow, ah. Fuck, no, that was stress. I don't like the design of it. Can I just add, this is obviously not sponsored, not gifted. Not gonna lie to you, I tried to reach out to Lula Bells myself, send up a little pitch, like, hey honeys, would you wanna work with me? Because I'm a strong, independent woman that goes after what she wants. Did I get a reply? No. So guys, if you're watching this, even though I just literally couldn't even put a ponytail in. I would love a little collab with you, honey. So here's me shooting my shot. The Lula Bells team watching this, like, blacklist. <laughs> just saying now, do you know what? We're gonna be real, this isn't easy. And that's okay. Beauty is pain. Right, so let's just slide that under there and go round, right round. <sighs> let's just wrap this round and hope for the best. I'm just gonna put like a fuckload of clips in. Let's just hopefully we can sort this out because seriously this, I'm getting hot and bothered. There's like so much hair on my lip gloss. That was the worst choice I've made of 2020. Joking, it really wasn't. I've made a lot of bad choices this year. Is it too big for my head though? My head is small, this is why. Is this overwhelming? It's so heavy. Colour wise, it's definitely starting to match me a bit more. Feels a bit more secure and I'm just gonna gently give it a brush because that was very rigorous. Oh my God. I do look bougie AF. Oh, I feel like so cute, like a 60s babe. Oh, I don't know, I kind of love this. Cause you can have it like from the front like this like or you could have it go into the back and it's just this gorgeous long ponytail and also you could have it lower down on your head like here and it would make it longer and less of like that high pony look so yeah this is the finished look what does everyone think does it even suit me like do i look like ariana I tried to do the Ari eyeliner today in the hopes that it would, but I don't know. I think it's a pretty shape, especially if you're someone like me doesn't like their head shape because it kind of covers it. This is from the back, so it, you can see. It does feel very pulley, but I love the little bounce. I think it's such a cute length, not too long as well. It's just like nice, more fashionable, but... It is a strain. Like, how does Ari do it? I was watching her on stage flip that ponytail around, singing like, oh. if I went like that, I would feel like it would come off. I don't know, but with the clips, it feels secure. And what's pretty about this is I feel like you can do so many different ways to wear it, as in, you could have two bits down, or you could have the side fringe. I was gonna do that today, but I thought this was just the most classic way to wear it. All to one side, hey. I do feel bad and bougie, like, I made the rules. The hair quality feels good overall, I'm impressed. It's bloody hard to get on, so please just bear that in mind before you purchase. I am not a hair expert, I'm sure most people, unless you are, would struggle, so. <laughs> I'm not lying when I say it's weird and difficult to get in. I feel like the girl on Hairspray. Hey mama, welcome to the 60s. Whoa, oh, 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 oh. This is my audition for Hairspray. Oh my god, I have such an urge to like watch that right now. Thanks so much for watching my video. Let me know if you would buy this afterwards. Make sure you wait because they always have a discount code, so don't buy it full price. You know, you gotta be on that real hustle, waiting for them discounts. Yeah, there was there's always 
deals if you're a student there's always deals but like usually they do 25% off and stuff they also have other extensions and thank you so much for watching and giving all you the positive vibes for a good week we're in leo season now the fucking energy is real this full moon just messed me up let me know if any of you get funny of a full moon if you don't know why people get funny over full moon it just like heightens everyone's emotions like shit gets real basically so yeah XOXO 